the Fun Fingertips Launch Pad. Fun to make and fun to play, if your heart can take it. Hey! This is my favourite Fun Fingertips. I think you're going to love it. The aim of the game is this, to see which player can place the most rockets onto the launch pad before... The flyers <laughs> just like that. Does that mean that I won? I think I, I don't know. Well, I did. See, the rules oh. of the game are this: whichever player places on the last rocket when it fires is the loser. And it is very nerve-wracking because you never know when the rockets are going to be fired until it's too late. Now, the firing mechanism is one of these. You may have seen one of these before. It is a popping ball. You turn it inside out, place it onto a table, and then just wait for it to pop. Ooh! Ooh. Pop one into the base of your launch pad and then you never know when it'll go. <laughs> <laughs> and we've given this a fingertips difficulty rating of one. Easy. Yes. Now, your launch pad base can be made from any shallow container. We are using just a margarine tub. And then you want to make it look more intergalactic for your space rocket. And a bit of silver paint does the trick. But a great fingertips top tip is to mix some PVA glue in with the paint and that way the paint will stick to your plastic tub. So give it a good mix around and then you can get painting. While Stephen's doing that, I'm going to show you how to make the actual launch pad. For this, all you need is a sheet of card. I'm going to use grey to go with the silver painted base. So draw around a dinner plate on the middle of your card all the way around and then cut it out. You can add some rivets using a black pen just to make it look a little bit more authentic. So I'll just add the finishing touches. And when your margarine tub has dried, you want to add a few rivets to that too to give it that special space station look. And now for the rockets. These are really easy. All you need is two triangular pieces of card, one with a slit at the bottom and one with a slit at the top. And then you just slot them together like that. Easy. Now, if you go to the Fingertips website and click on Fun, you'll find a template for the rockets that you can print off. The address is coming up soon. Then you want to paint your rockets and add on a few bolts in pen. And the nose cone is just a semi-circle of card rolled into a cone shape and stuck on top. And when you've made ten or so rockets, you're ready to play the game. Here we go. Let's go, Steve-o. I really like this one. Right. The Fun Fingertips launch pad. Great fun to play. But definitely not oh! for the faint-hearted. You all right, Stevie? I think I need to lie down. 